army chief under fire threatened take over as Tunubu is nowhere to be found. Mm, army chief, they don't talk and say this guy will betray Tunubu very, very soon. He has no choice because uh, his colleagues uh, are now on his neck and uh, even he himself, I don't think he knows what else to do because uh, his hands are very, very tight. This is exactly what can lead to military takeover. So what is he now wasting time for? Yes, of course, my people. Let's quickly go straight to the content and uh, see what actually has made him to be this on fire. All right, this is today's news. On Friday, the Nigerian military announced that it may intervene to control the escalating looting crisis and identify those sponsoring the ongoing nationwide hunger protest known as Embad Governance in Nigeria. The Chief of Defense Staff, General Christopher Musa, addressed the situation during a press conference held in Abuja. General Musa stated, We are supporting the police all through. We are just on standby. The police are doing a good job. They are handling the situation for now. He emphasized the military's role as a supportive force, ready to assist if the situation wasn't beyond the capacity of the police. The military readiness to step in underscores the seriousness of the current unrest and the government's concern over maintaining public order. Acknowledging the widespread discontent among the protesters, General Musa noted the challenging economic conditions facing the country. He expressed an understanding of the grievances of the Nigerian people, particularly in the context of the global economic and security crisis. So we want to call on all Nigerians to understand the government if you have grievances, which I know people have a lot of challenges here and there. And it is not only in Nigeria alone. Everywhere in the world is facing one economic or security crisis on the other, he said. Thank you for listening to today's news. See, that is a trick. If anything that makes the military to come in, know it that they are taking over. I'll be waiting at this side talk. Yes, look at it. Once the military comes in to support the Nigerian police, hmm? The next thing they will do is to get into Asorok. And anything that will make the military to break into Asorok, know it that Asorok will be taken over. You understand? It will be taken over. So I'm not even sure that the police will even want them to give them a helping hand. Because that is a trick. See, the military is the army. Uh, the army is a very, very uh, 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 um, uh, secretive um, force. You will never know what their next line of action will be. That is why it was said that this army chief should not be present. You know, they, you know, they town now. <laughs> Hey, I beg me could me could check the matter. Me could know where the matter the hot reach. Um, all right. Um, please, uh, my peer, dear listeners, listening to me through this very channel, Paul Ahmed Tunubu do you know, and cause we get. And the worst part is that it's not even ready to fix the situation. No be anybody fault with that. Okay. Um, please don't forget your comment. Don't forget to 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 leave them below the comment section. Click. On the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos.